पैसेंजर है ड्रिंक किए हुए मिलते हैं तो हमको डाउट होता है कि वो आगे जाके पैसा देगा कि नहीं फिर कभी मार के हमारा ही छील नहीं तो भरोसा मोस्टली तो गाड़ी बाईस ट्वेंटी थ्री ट्वेंटी फोर दिन चलती है स्वतः रिक्शा चल तो आम्मी लेट नाइट पालू शको दा वजेपर्यंत अक आणि भाड्याची रिक्षा असल्यामुळे आम्हाला आठ तासात ड्युटी करावं लागते तो मंथली कभी पंधरा हजार बी होत आहे कभी अगर अच्छा भाडा मिळा तर बीस हजार बी जात आहे या कभी टेंट हाऊस आहे रिक्षावाले को एक सही तरीके नाही बुलाते हे रिक्षा जरा हे रिक्षा चल लेके चल फटाफट भगा ऐसे ऐसे लोक बोलते राहते हैे तो भी आपण कंट्रोल करणार पडतात सुनणार पडतात दारू पिऊन की बोलतात इकडे या साईडला चल आणि एकदा गल्ली गोळ जातात आणि मारतात कभी कभी कोई जबरदस्ती बी बॅठ जात आहे We are taking a closer look into the lives of auto drivers. And why? Because 75% of the global auto rickshaw population is here in India. They are a disgruntled bunch. But here's a business that's making their lives better and in the process making us the commuters a happier bunch. 23 crores a day. That's the number of trips auto drivers make each day in India. Yet they belong to India's unorganized economy. Changing this is Aishwarya Raman's social enterprise Auto Raja. She and the team at Auto Raja are providing Chennai city's auto drivers with access to institutional finance, affordable healthcare and quality education for their children whilst providing the city's commuters with autos on call and at regulated prices. So Aishwarya, 75% of the world's auto rickshaw population is here That's in right. India. That's right. Right? Yeah. Um and 23 crores trips every single day. That's right. <laughs> Absolutely. And that big large population of auto drivers all belongs to the unorganized economy. That's right. That's right. What are the problems associated with belonging in, with such a large population belonging to the unorganized economy? So if you are a private company employee, you would get pension, you'd have medical insurance, but an auto driver across the country doesn't have any of this um the driver again uh does not get a fixed income every month so he's ultimately an a, a da daily wa wage earner so what that means is that the driver you know has to be smart in saving uh saving money but more often than not that's not the case most of our drivers do squander away all their hard earned money in alcohol and tobacco what's the percentage um, you think that 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 has um, a substance abuse problem uh i would say that's easily more than 75% wow another kind of problem that a driver in a city faces is that many of them are migrants in chennai for instance half of our drivers are from villages in kanchipuram district so they spend four days in chennai driving an auto and the other three days back home farming So wow yeah yeah so they take a 12 hour train ride back to their village and why do they do that do they believe that there's no money in driving an auto rickshaw than in farming or they not need it on the farm for those four days um it's both okay it's both they the farms are overcrowded there's underemployment at a large level so you have them trying to supplement the income for their families by driving an auto in the city So this is just the problem of the auto driver most of them don't have sufficient uh income to support six member families a lot of them continue well everybody continues to live in slums and slum rehabilitation centers for over two decades now and as a result you know they don't have medical benefit they don't have uh access to institutional credit um So yeah so all of these are problems of the auto drivers okay now in light of this yeah what is an average auto driver's income yeah um and, and and of that if he doesn't own the auto how much is he paying yeah benefits? yeah so so if i am going to rent an auto from a seat in <laughs> in chennai uh, from a private money lender in chennai i would pay anywhere between 150 and 250 daily So this is his fixed cost. Okay. He can't do away with this. Okay. So And how much what, if I was an auto driver and I'm paying 250 bucks yeah. as rent? How much is my potential to earn in that day? So you're not going to earn more than 600 rupees a day. Even if the driver were to drive 12 hours a day and we are expecting him to, you know, comply by the norms, you know, charge only 12 rupees a kilometer, he's not going to drive more than 100 kilometers a day. And 
40 kilometers out of this 100 kilometers is empty. This is your dead mileage. His earning is not going to be more than 350 rupees a day. This 350 is excluding the fuel cost. He spends as much as 250 to 400 rupees every day on just fuel. He spends again 150 to 250 on um, the daily auto rickshaw rent. This is also translates into an EMI if they have bought a, a loan to get an auto rickshaw. And then of course with the 350 remaining he needs to spend on himself. A lot of the men drivers spend 150 rupees on alcohol and tobacco. And that leaves him with just 200 rupees for his family. And he needs to cover food, clothing, shelter, education and medicine. That's about 6,000 rupees a month. Yes, 6,000 6, to 9,000. He works every single day of the month. Every single day of the month. Aishwarya goes on to talk about the middle class lifestyle that auto drivers aspire for, the vicious debt cycles they get into and the need for a holistic approach to solving their socio-economic problems. So there are drivers who go to private money lenders for a lot of reasons. They are people, these are drivers in slums and slum rehabilitation centers but with middle class aspirations. So even if one of the driver's granddaughter is celebrating their first birthday, the driver ends up spending 80,000 rupees on the whole birthday bash. He has no idea that this is vulgar consumerism. But he spends so much money. He goes to a private money lender for this amount. In, and he's not able to repay, so he's going to borrow more money from others. The second thing we do is we facilitate the access of the driver and their family to um, affordable health care. We have amazing private hospitals that have come forward in this whole initiative. So, so we train on the drivers on the one hand on emergency response, first aid and emergency response, because every hospital and every citizen recognizes that if there is an accident on the road, the first person to react positively, constructively is an auto driver. For an auto driver, his life and family is auto. He'll do everything to protect and run the vehicle to run his family. We'll try to save every penny possible. We'll buy vegetable from where I get the lowest price because every rupee is important for an auto driver to manage his life expense. Daily I earn rupees 500. I budget rupees 5000 every month to pay EMI. I'll have rupees 1500 to rupees 2000 at home for any emergency. Every day rupees 200 I'll give to wife. After what is spent for the house, balance amount go for saving for EMI. I'll also save some money in the bank whenever I have some extra collection. End of the month, we'll pool all this money and if any short, lost two to three days of collection, will be saved for this and pool EMI. In between, if any crisis comes or hospitalization, then the entire planning will go for a toss and will not be able to pay that money. <laughs> I have two EMIs due. This happened when my child fell sick. Child was hospitalized and had to take six injections. I couldn't run auto. Also had to spend 4,500 in the hospital. I couldn't pay the EMI. 
whenever any such family crisis comes family is important and will postpone emi ായിരം <laughs> 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 എന്റെ പേര് കൃഷ്ണകുമാർ ഇതുവരെ ഫിനാൻസിനെ സംബന്ധിച്ച് യാതൊരു ബുദ്ധിമുട്ടും എനിക്ക് ഉണ്ടായിട്ടില്ല I also have a cow that gives me income. Daily collection I leave with my mother. She knows that end of the month I need to pay EMI. So what she collected and if any short in EMI, she'll put from the income from cow and give me money to pay EMI. ഓട്ടോസ്റ്റാൻഡ് <laughs> income from both these business i'll use to build up my monthly emi commitment help vandi odichu loan adikkana undu undu odikkana undu appo padayathinte business nalla profitable aanu pondu profitable aanu pondu profitable aanu pondu ee athyavashyam funding ekka varumbo adhe namukku test nu pona allekil insurance nu pona aa samayangal engane additional fund manage cheyyanu to meet emergency requirement We have a driver's union fund. We contribute every week and we can draw the money based on our need at the rate of rupees 4 per rupees 100 loan a month to be paid in 110 days. That's how many people are going to do it. I'm 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 going to do it.